Michael Buffer, and let's get ready for BET.com. To be involved in the biggest fight in boxing history is truly a blessing. I'm happy for this fight, and uh, finally it's happening. The timing is there for this to be the biggest money fight of all time. To see these two guys together in the ring uh, on May 2nd is something special. We've seen unprecedented interest in this fight, both from the media, from tickets, from motel rooms, from airlines. It's, it's insane. This will be... Uh, the biggest fight that I'll be a part of. I think it's just the greatest competition of the two best fight, two, be two fighters at, at their best fighting each other, and it's just it's something the world wants to see. You know, I'm blessed to be where I'm at, and uh, I'm pretty sure Manny feels the same way. And it's, it's an intriguing matchup. We both want to fight. Our team, uh, our teams came together, and we made the fight happen. Is there anything training-wise we haven't seen from you before? I'm just working hard every day, just pushing myself each and every day. You know, as soon as the, the press conference is over and I got to go shoot my commercial with Manny, you know, right back to training. It's all about work. This is one of the most important fights in my, in my boxing career, and, and uh, we're waiting for this fight a uh, long time ago, since uh, five years. So five years in the beginning, and finally it's happening now, so I'm excited. Yes, um, this. Uh, will be the uh, you know the answer of all the question in, in, in the minds of the fans. The victory is very important uh, for my country and for the fans of boxing and also to prove that um, uh, who's the pound, number one pound for pound. I believe that is what are you waiting for since uh, five years ago? May 7th, the fight of the century. It's all about the best, fight the best. It's been a long road, but we're here now. Mayweather Pacquiao, the biggest fight in boxing history. The buzz here is tremendous. I mean, we got the Goodyear blimp flying over. It's the first time that's ever happened at a press conference. Yeah, there are more people here than are at the Academy Awards. There really are. This is, this is, this is unbelievable. It's great. Was there ever a time you thought the deal might not happen? Often. <laughs> Often. But you know what? They were both gentlemen. They both came together. And, uh, you know, I'm really happy we're here. Now, among all the programming that you've ever had a part, you know, a part in, can you talk about where this ranks? This is way up there. This is way up there. I've done, obviously, a lot of television shows, a lot of dramas, comedies, reality shows, NFL deals, NCAA deals. I've never done this, uh, a cultural event that was this significant. Your level of excitement as both an executive and as a fan. Well, it's off the charts. I mean, I, I, I knew this was big when we announced the fight was happening, but I didn't know it was this big. So this is really exciting for us. Thrilled to be a part of it and had a hand in helping it come to fruition. And we're ready to go and a lot of work to do between now and May 2nd. What would you like to see it do for the sport of boxing? Listen, what it's doing already. Make people talk about it, make it relevant. Make it relevant to the level that it's supposed to be, that it used to be. These great noble warriors that risk themselves when they go in that ring, they come out of that ring with less of themselves quite often. Let it, let it be, let, let the sport be greater. Let it be great like it once was. It could be the fight of the century because Mayweather's legs are slowed down. He's going to have to exchange more. It's going to make it more exciting. I think they get, the, the, the exchanges will be much more often more, more often, because Mayweather can't move like he used to. If it was five years ago, I would give Mayweather a better chance because he was a much better mover back then and Manny would have to chase him more. This time, Manny's not going to have to chase him so much. He's going to find him. I'm super excited about the fight, man. It's going to be epic, man. This is like the fight, I don't know, the decade, you know, almost a century, actually, man. I mean, people have been waiting on this fight, man, and uh, it's going to be a good fight, but, you know, Money May going to take it. It's just, it's just, he, he's a boxer, he's a student of the game. He can brawl when he needs to brawl, but, you know, he going to mix it up. Now, Floyd is the homie. Have you ever actually, um, like, been in the gym or trained or done any, even just, like, gloves or any type of training with him, seen it firsthand? No, no, his, his training is a little bit more, uh, 
vigorous than, than the training I like to do now. My football days are done, so I do I do enough to stay in shape. But it's, it, it is it's a great pleasure to watch um, somebody who take their training regimen so seriously and, and has been doing it for a long time. I mean, longevity is important in any sport, and somebody who's been uh, keeping up and doing it that hard for that long just shows a lot. Boxing has, you know, took me places I never thought I would be able to go in life. So, you know, boxing is everything to me. You know, I, you know, I love the sport of boxing, but uh, my fans, the fans all over the world, you know, I take my hat off to you guys and just want to say thank you. And now that you have a family, does that give you a heightened sense of winning this fight for your legacy to them? Yes, um, to win this fight and the, the honor that I'm bringing to the country is uh, very important and, of course, to my family. Yes, I consider this a, a, a fight of the century and it's going to be... A